You guys, I want to share something with you guys that the Lord just showed me. So I'm deep in prayer and I'm like, Lord, help me to forgive like you forgive. Help me to love like you love. Show me, Jesus. Show me how to do it. And like the merciful, loving Savior that he is, he said, get rid of that cloth that's up above your bed there. And I'm like, oh, I can't get rid of that. <laughs> My child gave that to me. That's the only thing that I have from her that I'll ever have. That, that's the, the cloth that this little girl gave to me that I'll, I'll probably, the only thing I have a memory of her and the only time I ever saw her, she gave it to me as a gift. I can't, I can't throw that away. And he said, all right, I'll let you keep that cloth as long as you understand the lesson that I'm trying to teach you is that You couldn't throw that away, right? Because it's a value. It's a value to you. He says, so why are you holding on to unforgiveness like it's a value to you? And I was thinking, ooh. I didn't look at it that way. <laughs> And I was like, I'm mind blown. I mean, because it's like, he's like, you're holding on to unforgiveness. Like it's a value to you. You know, and I see so many people struggle with the same things. Like somebody hurt me and I'm never going to forgive them. And I'm never going to. Why are you holding on to that like it's of something of value? Throw it away. Jesus is saying to me, throw it away. It's not of any value to you. But you're holding on to it like it's this precious gem. And I see so many people struggle with it. Backbiting and gossip and hatred and envy and strife and why are you holding on to that stuff like it's a value throw it away it's of no value throw it away 